Hi guys, this is Berry Babe checking in and it's officially my birthday. It's like 12.06 or something a.m. Sunday morning and I just got home and I'm out for a walk. So I'm going to not film my face. I don't want to make you seasick. So I know that people have questions about my day. So I'm going to try and just not have a picture. I'm sorry if it's too boring. I guess you just have to listen today. So today I was same, the same, yay. So it's day two of purgatory and I was the same. Uh, it would have been nice if I'd been down a little bit more, but my God, 151.1. I can't, I can't really have a problem with that. So today was the big doctor appointment with the surgeon that did my breast lift. How did it go? Well, you know, I got this little thing on my wrist now, my new Fitbit, and it tells me what my heart rate is. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I got up to like 96 waiting in the waiting room for him. So I had to find two things before I left. And do you think I could find them? I was tearing everything apart. I had to find the, the pathology bill from the hospital, and which cost me $307. And I had gotten an itemized bill to be able to show him what I had to pay extra because he didn't realize when he sent, he, he took out some tissue and he sent it for pathology, not realizing that was coming out of my pocket, even though it's in his paperwork. And, <clears throat> excuse me, so then I um, reminded him that he said he would try and help me get the pathologist who read the report for $370. So that makes $670 over the cost of my procedure. That's 10% toward a new, another procedure right so you know he has been so hot and cold with me in the past that i didn't know what i was going to get he he does not like to ever admit that he made a mistake but to be honest he always has made good on anything and people say well why do you keep going to him well as my <laughs> my internist my family doctor says when she's got me up in the stirrups. The man's an artist. So this thing with my breasts, I don't know. So as the swelling has gone down, so has volume. So right after surgery, I bought um, my favorite bra and I used to be a D and I bought a C. And at the time, the C cup fit on the left and the B cup fit on the right. But the band was too tight. A 42 was too tight, and I had all that muffin top all the way around. And I've been trying, I mean, we've trimmed a little bit when I had my arms done, but I still need more. So that's one of the reasons I wanted to get down lower. So the <laughs> traffic was horrendous. We were 20 minutes late. I called ahead and said, because they, you know, I've waited over an hour before. You just never know how long it's going to be. Sometimes I get right in, sometimes I wait and wait and wait. So I call ahead and, and the girl says, this is one I don't know. She says, well, are you going to be more than 20 minutes late? And I said, no, don't think so. But it was, we were heading toward University of Michigan and they were having a big soccer tournament and it was raining and it was bumper to bumper for miles and miles and miles. And we were late getting out of the house because I had trouble finding the bra. I bought, brought these bras at Kohl's, but I didn't take the tags off because I thought, well, I may have to take them back and exchange them. So, because, you know, I had a coupon and 30% off and all that stuff. So, he, oh, so when I got there, the waiting room was jam-packed, and I found out that they had double-booked everybody. I don't know if there was a screw-up or what. So I thought, oh, okay, you tell me to hurry. When I called, they said, oh, yeah, we're pretty much caught. We're almost caught up. 
liar, liar, pants on fire, I don't know. So I only waited 20 minutes and then they got me in. And they took me to the treatment room. I'd never been in there before. They don't usually put patients in there unless they're doing procedures or something. So I said to the woman that walked me back, I said, is it gonna be very long? And she said, no, that's why he wanted me to put you in here. Like, okay. So I get into my little gown and, and um, I hear him go into the, a room, one of the rooms and then next he's in with me. And he comes in like I was his lost long daughter. You know, all the, all the, I mean, he, he didn't do a real great job on this right breast. He took tissue out, and now it's a whole cup size smaller. And then it cost me $670 if I can't get insurance to pay part of it to, to biopsy healthy tissue. So anyway, he had another little doctor, female doctor with him. And I think they're like doing internships or rotating observations. And this one I didn't mind. But they didn't stand like right across from me and she didn't stand right next to him. The doctor kind of came around to my side. So the surgery, the, the, the healing is going pretty well. I won't get into details. But I did point out that they were not the right, they're not the same size. So he's like, mm, mm, mm. I said, no, I have a tit and a titlet. And he hates it. He says, don't call it a titlet. He hates it when I call the little one a titlet. I said, you know, I wanted tits. I got a tit and a titlet. So I really didn't want a B. When, when we got down, when it got down to it, I said, you know, I can show you the difference. This left one was a C. The one on the right was a B. Well, I put this bra on, and he said, I like this bra. Well, thank you. And, but it's, um, it, it snaps in the front, so it has a wider band, because I always have all this skin hanging over. Well, I've lost enough weight that the 42 fits. I really needed a 44 before, but they don't, they don't, you have to go to the fat lady department to get 44s in a nice bra. So he said, this is a bally. That's, I, <laughs> I was like, I'm thinking, how do you know it's a bally bra? I mean, I guess he knows his tits after all. So needless to say, he's saying, well, we really need to blah, blah here and blah, blah there. And, and um, I said, well, because I'm a lot smaller, I really wanted to be a full C. I carried Bazumba D's all my life. And the more your boobs stick out, the less people notice your stomach sticking out, even though I hope to be totally rid of that. So, anyway, I was just, I set my timer on my Fitbit, but I forgot to hit it. So if I go over, I have to record, re-record all this. So I'm at eight minutes. You're getting the front of you. You're getting those famous tits. Is what you're seeing. Don't watch it. It'll make you seasick. So anyway, I had been talking about a, um, a back lift, and what I'd like him to do is cut me up both sides and do the back lift. Well, I don't know if he's going to do that. But I said, what about implants? He said, we could do that. I said, well, how much is it going to cost me? He said. Oh, I think we have a pair around here somewhere. <laughs> so, okay, when was the last time, you know, these things are $1,000 a piece. Somebody said, well, they may have just a pair hanging around. So I said, what you're proposing sounds good as long as I can afford it because I had budgeted for this back procedure. I don't have any money to fix this front situation. But when I had a fiasco with the first time he did my thighs, he found a way for insurance to pay for it. He is a partner in the private hospital that does a lot of bariatric surgeries. So um, when he's kind of using insurance or that sort of thing, he takes me there. 
and their prices are too high for me to pay out of pocket, so I always end up going to one of the local hospitals. But in his own hospital, he could fudge on timing. So he's going to work up. He said, I go, I go back in six weeks, and he's thinking that we can do the next surgery end of, August, end of October into November. Well, I'm going to go to Florida in late January, February. So I want to, like, he assured me he could get me in fast. Well, he can't assure me that at the hospital, at the regular hospitals. So I'm going to try and trust him. I don't know. I have sent him a lot of business because I've had a lot done over the years. He works well with previously obese people and all their extra skin. <laughs> 